everyone. So I've just done my, what I got in the January sales haul video, which is why I'm wearing the exact same clothes. I'm just going to do this straight after. So hopefully you don't mind watching that one and then watching this one. I'm sure I'll get comments saying you do too many haul videos, but I have been out shopping recently and I wanted to show you the other bits and pieces I got that weren't in the sale. So I'm going to get straight into it. Here we go and I hope you enjoy it. So the first new thing that I've got is the top that I'm wearing and I really really love it, I've wanted to go on for ages, um, it's the Geek top and I got it in white, I saw it in the petite section um, so I just thought I'd grab it because I didn't see it actually anywhere else in the top shop I was in. I really like the rolled up sleeves, like they come like this so you don't have to do it yourself and obviously they're sewn into place so they're not going to keep falling down. Because I just think that just makes it look really casual but quite on trend as well. And yeah, it's a really good quality t-shirt. I think it was about £18, which some people would say is a lot for a t-shirt. And you know, you could pick up one in Primark much cheaper and stuff. But it's actually really thick. Um, it's not always the case in Topshop. Sometimes their t-shirts can be really thin, just exactly like Primarks. But it's really good quality. I really just like these, they're really on trend at the moment. I'm not always the type of girl that wears something just because it's on trend, but I like them. So I picked this one up and I love it. So that's that. The next thing I got might be a little bit boring, but I got some new Lee jeans. And I got these ones this time because I really liked the colour. I don't think they say a colour, I think they're just grey, but they're a kind of like a purpley colour when you look at them against the other colours that they had. Um, I've got a few pairs of Lee jeans, one that I ruined with paint because I stupidly wore them when I was painting so that was ridiculously dumb but these were £38, I really love them, they're really soft, they're a perfect length on me because they're ankle grazers but I'm quite short so they're a good length, they, they, they do come to my ankle, they don't like go to the floor or anything but they fit me well and the thing I love about these I love Primark jeans, don't get me wrong, and the thing I don't like about these is that they have like the button and the zip and the Primark ones that I get don't, but even after washing the, washing the Primark ones loads of times, the dye still comes out of them on your hands, and by the end of the day, if you've been like working or out or whatever, your hands look a weird bluish colour, like there's something wrong with you, and these ones don't tend to do that as much, I don't know if they do to some people because it says colour may transfer on to garments blah 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 but they don't tend to do it like the Primark ones do so I guess in that case you get what you pay for because Primark £9, Topshop 38 so I do have a mixture and I wear both but I just thought I'd pick up a slightly higher quality pair just for once instead of going to Primarks. I felt like I got loads of stuff that day but obviously I didn't because some of it was in my last haul because some of it was some of the things I got were sale items, so if you haven't watched that yet, go and watch that if you want to see the other bits and bobs that I picked up from Topshop that day. So I also got this, which is very unsuitable for the time of year, but it's this little lace crop top. I just fell in love with it, I thought it was so cute, so pretty. Um, it was £15, it's got a lot of work in it, and I just absolutely love it, and I'm going to save this for when it's hot, or going on holiday, or even like on a night out, I can envision it with a pair of disco pants and shoes, um, this looking really cute. So I've got to keep up my workout, my ab workout, so that I have a toned stomach so I can wear crop tops. Crop tops are definitely going to be back in fashion this spring, summer, I can see it now. And the last thing I got in Top Shop that wasn't in the sale was a pair of leggings. This is really boring. But again, this sounds really weird coming from me because you know I'm such a Primark girl. I absolutely love it and I would never, like, knock Primark. But I wanted a better quality pair of leggings. And these do seem better. Obviously, I'm going to have to wear them first. They were £12.00. And yeah, I'm going to test them out to see if the quality really is that much better than Primark. So yeah, I got like a couple of basics in there and like a pretty crop top and stuff. So that's what I picked up in Topshop. But I also went to H&M, which is one of my favourite shops. And I got some things which, to look at, you would think it's about April, May time. But it's not, it's January. <laughs> but I just really love them, so I'm going to show you what I got. The first one is this really beautiful pink corally jumper. 
I think it like matches my hair garland quite well, so I really like it. Um, and it's got like a slight pattern on it. It's really soft. Again, it's an Angora blend, which is like the blue one in my last video. And this was 19.99. Angora is always more expensive because it's really soft and cosy. And yeah, I just loved the colour. How pink tops and things don't tend to suit me as much, but this darker, kind of brighter, more vibrant colour is okay on me. So I thought I'd pick that up. And to match, I also got these, which are really cool. They're trousers. And they have a very kind of bright floral design on them. I think, again, with a black top, these are going to look more kind of not as in your face because you can't wear something really vibrant and clashy on the top unless you're very brave. But it does have the same kind of pinks in it. So I think this tucked into these is going to look really cute when the weather starts to get a bit nicer. So all I want is for it to be spring right now. But these are 14 99 which I think is amazing. And yes totally love these i also got this little jumper which is so cute um it looks like this and it's all kind of speckled in orange purple and green kind of flex but the base color is like a pinkish tone i think like, it's really hard to describe the like print and color of this but i just liked it nevertheless and it has really kind of thin long sleeves but it's quite a short little jumper. So again, because it's not really, really thick, you can tuck it into high-waisted trousers while it's still cold and it will look quite cute, I think. Did I say the price of this one? It's 14 99 if I didn't say that already. The next thing that I got was this blouse. Now, I've kind of gone off blouses lately, which is crazy, but this one I do like. It's a cream colour and it's covered in crosses. So, yeah, I really like this. Again, just tuck it into high-waisted trousers and you can't go wrong, that's what I always say. This was 12 99 and it is quite sheer if you can see it in real life, but it's not that chiffon material. It's kind of more like a cottony, soft, very soft material. So you might have to wear something under it, but it's quite thin and floaty, longer at the back and again just looking forward to wearing that because this is definitely something that can be worn at this time of the year and you're not going to look like you're on your summer holidays basically like I probably will in some of my stuff and then the final thing I got was this jumper this is a very thick woolly jumper which is fine for this time of the year I just picked it up because it looked really cosy it zips all the way down the back which is kind of random but it's a nice little detail I think that's purely what's for otherwise it would be a bit weird having the back open maybe you could like turn it the other way and wear it as a cardigan is that what it's for no surely that's not what it's for I think I've just made that up in my head but if that is what it's for then that's amazingly cool but yeah I like that and it was 12 99 so yeah that's everything I picked up on my Topshop H&M trip if you enjoyed this video then please take the time to subscribe and like it and I'll be back with another video soon thanks for watching everyone bye